the Rabbitohs have blown the eels out of the water with a stellar win at ANZ Stadium to reignite a dream of reaching the Premiership finals. It was a stunning effort by Nathan Merritt, who scored five of Monday's eight tries, matching the South Sydney record of most tries scored by a player during one game. The boys enjoyed a recovery session of yoga and swimming at All Sorts Fitness in Central Sydney following the match, where Merritt was quick to downplay the massive feat. I think the victory, you know, overwhelms the five tries, you know, uh, the five tries will, will be something that I'll look back on after my career's finish and, you know, I'll soak it up then and, and you know, look at the, the achievement that I achieved. While NRL.com broke the news that Greg Inglis's preferred position would be fullback, Merritt proved he's well equipped to take on the custodian role as he replaced injured Reese Wesser for the match. A fullback gives you, you know, opportunity to roam around, you know, and go looking for the ball and, you know, we got we got a you know a good bunch of boys that can offload and you know and make half breaks so you know it's just a matter of me you know popping up at the right times. Inglis scored a double in the 56 to six thrashing and although looking a little sore on Tuesday, he's certainly proving he's back to his best. Winger Chris McQueen had a star performance playing a roving role, showing recent years of injury since his first grade debut are far behind him. The 2009 season, I did my ACL. And then five and a half months after that, I re-ruptured it and missed the whole 2010 season. And then I uh, came back and played my first game back in the NRL round two this year. With all sights now on the Raiders, the Rabbitohs know they can't slacken off. Sitting four points outside the top eight, the Bunnies will need to win almost every remaining game of the season to secure a finals berth. And although the competition has already been decided for some clubs, McQueen says every game for them is crucial. Any team to threat, you know, you, you can't expect to win any game. Um, so we just need to go down there and, and be switched on and hopefully play the way we did last night. They'll be good out wide. Josh Dugan and, and their edge backs are, are going to be good, so we really have to keep an eye on them. To add to their strength, steamrolling prop Dave Taylor made his return from a five-game suspension and will be a valuable addition for the following weeks when they meet the Cowboys, Broncos and Knights. South's Round 23 clash with the Raiders will be at Canberra Stadium on Sunday afternoon. Amy Lynn Sell for NRL.com.